And hello everyone, Lights and Gear is here with a product review. And today I have a battery charger from PowerX. Uh, this is the MH980. And as you might be able to see, this is for NIMH batteries or NICD batteries only. It will not charge lithium ion. So basically it's for AA and AAA cells. And PowerX um, is one of the uh, pioneers of chargers. I remember years ago they had the Maha charger, or when the Maha came out, it was one of the first um, uh, NIMH battery chargers that, uh, that I knew much about and it was very very popular. So anyway, uh, this being the MH980, it has uh, a number of uh, reasonably good features and will also be able to charge batteries in a tur it also has a turbo mode setting so you can uh, charge them in uh, about half the time as normally you would charge a AA battery. Um, it does however have a couple of other modes. It has the conditioning mode which will uh, rescue a degraded battery and it also uh, gives them a little exercise and um, is good for batteries that have been sitting around for a while and may not have been used. It rejuvenates and recycles them and um, uh, does however require as they say up to about 24 hours to complete the cycle but it is recommended they say about every six months to a year uh, to ensure good battery performance. And the uh, output on the charger is quite strong. The default charging is um, is 1.0, and that's for a double A battery, or 0 0.5 for a triple A. And the turbo mode will charge at two amps for a double A and one amp for triple A's. And uh, here are your basic uh, charging times over here. Uh, they do say if you charge in um, the turbo mode. That it will probably take about one to one and a half hours otherwise it's probably about two to two and a half hours for the standard charging mode i've kind of been uh, covering up the charger all the time here it is it's not terribly terribly um large but it is about uh, eight inches wide or eight inches long i guess and uh, about four inches wide this way but uh, it takes up to eight char eight, eight batteries at a time if that has not been uh, clear at this at the, in, until now and uh, on the back it has a little fan here so as soon as you plug it in and turn it on the fan starts uh, powering up just to make sure that things don't get too heated up now the uh, package will include the charger the actual unit itself and the AC adapter so here that is it says uh, Maha, Maha on it so uh, let me plug that in So, as soon as you uh, attach the cable to the back over here, or attach the, the charger, the adapter to the back, it'll start making little sounds. And the display lights up for a couple of seconds. You can't see it now, it's kind of dimmed. But um, here are the buttons on the side here. This is the turbo on the right hand side, and over here is the conditioning button. Now, if you don't wish to do either of those things, the easy thing to do is to just place batteries in the in the in the uh, in the slots, and it'll go ahead and do exactly what it wants. Here are um, some PowerX batteries I have here, and IMH AA. So once you start placing the batteries in the slots, things will start uh, happening, and they do recommend uh, that you put them in from left to right, one at a time. There goes the fan, and uh, the fan is a little bit on the noisy side, so I don't think I'd want to have this close to me if I was uh, doing something, um, because, I don't know, the fan can be white, mo white noise if you want, if, you, if you'd like that, but um, otherwise it is a tad on the noisy side, and the fan kind of continues, it sort of stays stays with it right during the whole process until until the battery stopped charging so if you don't mind the fan noise anyway so here's what it's doing it's just doing an automatic charge now of these cells without me doing anything i just place them in so the default uh, output is one amp and if i was to do turbo i would have to select that 
right after I put the first battery in. I'd place the battery in and within a few seconds I'd have to press the turbo button to get turbo to start uh, operating and of course it'll say over here in the display on the side it'll, it'll indicate that that's turbo and same for the conditioning mode I have to make the choice right away as soon as I put a battery in the slot and then press the conditioning button over here and that'll start that process um, all the battery, well, no matter how many batteries you have in here, they're all, they cannot be individually set. Once, once condition is set, all the batteries will be conditioned. Once turbo is set, they'll all be set on turbo. So you can't have um, two batteries on one, two batteries on another, and two batteries doing something else. So, as you can see in the display here, what the little thing does here, I guess I can kind of... Uh, wake this up. It uh, keeps going back and forth and shows what's going on with each battery continuously. There's battery 1, battery 2, battery 3, so it's showing that it's putting in you know the MAH for each one of these cells. And then once the charge is finished it'll say done and it says if one is done before the other, then when the arrow points to that one, it'll say done, but another one may not say done. So, you know, kind of works in that, in that fashion. So, uh, let's continue charging these, at least, and uh, we'll see what happens here as soon as they get to the end and are fully charged. Okay, now here we are a little while later, and I think as you can see, the, uh, the batteries, the PowerX batteries I have in here have finished and uh, everything is done now and um, it says done right there on the bottom so that's what you get and it's still showing the arrow to each one of the slots in there and with each slot it's changing the MAH or changing the amount of energy that was placed into each battery as it says that doesn't necessarily mean what the um, or indicate what the capacity is of the battery it's just showing the energy that went in so there you go and that's what it looks like when everything is finished so um, that's how you do the basic charging with the power x and um, so if i was to do um, something else or the only other thing you can do is to condition batteries but i just had a couple of um, triple a's here so just to show with the um, different uh, size of course and they go in a little bit differently since the, since they're smaller so in this instance I just press turbo on there as soon as I put the battery in and of course that will do a, a faster a faster charge than it was doing earlier and if I put another battery in there the same then both of them will be charging in turbo and um, so, anyway, that's how you do something else with them. And like, likewise, if I was going to do the, uh, the conditioning cycle, I would press this button as soon as I put the batteries in. So that's how you work the PowerX, the PowerX MHC980. It's um, only for AAA and um, AA batteries, but if that's, if that's what you'd like to do, and uh, you'd like to be able to do a lot of them at once, then I think the Power X would probably work pretty well for you. Uh, there is a link below in the description. You can pick one of these up on Amazon for a decent price. So check that link and go to uh, lightsandgear.com for flashlights, batteries, and more chargers, reviews, and so forth. So anyway, uh, thanks for watching the video. Any comments, uh, let me know below, and we'll see you next time. Take it easy.